Mm, damn, Q. Maybe you did that. Back in the building for another episode of the Beers Bourbon Whiskey Podcast. Got my man Angry Principal off camera. What's up? Got my man Bo in the building. I'll show you. And of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205, man. Everybody loves BBW, dog. That's Beards, Bourbon, Whiskey. Dog, we're going back to Tennessee, right? Isn't that where yep. it is? Tennessee. Yeah, Tennessee. Uncle Nears, dog. Tennessee. Everybody know our love of Uncle Nears, right? So I done had quite a few of these. We had the uh 1856 the what's the other one 19 the green level the green level right <laughs> right let's just say I, the say that, yeah. Yeah, so. I can't remember all the numbers i can't remember all the goddamn numbers so now we're going to the rye all right um actually we had the other one too i gotta post that one <laughs> we did do another uh uncle nears i gotta post that one but uh so we we to the rye now so i did have a few experiences with rye that I didn't really like rye whiskey. And it wasn't until you told me, Angry Principal, that rye was the original whiskey. Right. I didn't even know that. Like, mm-hmm. I, so rye was the original thing. So, we back to Uncle Nears. Uh, anything, because I know you tried this at the actual distillery. I went to uh, the distillery. distillery. Okay. Mm-hmm. So, at first you could only get it at the distillery. Gotcha. It was like they were selling that, distillers cut, and a couple others that you mm-hmm. could only get there. And now they've started putting this out on the shelves, and you can get it at... Just about anywhere. anywhere right, for that's, sure. that's, that's that's pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, like I said, if anybody gives a chance, Uncle Nears has the best mm-hmm. distillery. Hands down. down <laughs> of anybody. Any distillery I've been to, Uncle Nears outshines them all. Yeah, it's okay. just that nice thing. I gotta get down there. So and, and you went and it wasn't even completely open yet, right? No, it was it's it's a Okay, full, this was this was so after the yeah, you, pandemic. If you go down, okay. you can only Tour the distillery on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Got gotcha. you. Mm-hmm. Because the rest of the week, it's a working farm. Got gotcha. you. Mm-hmm. So they actually growing everything. They're really they, working out there. They really are working out there. Yeah, and they're okay. building and building and building. Mm-hmm. And it's more of the other color than us that are actually there. <laughs> the other so color. So all I can say is support the people. <laughs> the other Head color. on down. It's 25 minutes outside of downtown Nashville. Okay. Go take a trip over there. It's worth it. Have yeah. lunch. Do the tour, do everything. It is definitely yeah. worth your time. And their gift sure. store is the biggest one I've seen out of anyone. Yeah, okay. that's, that's a ass nice ass facility, <laughs> right? That's nice a nice facility, man. For that's what's up. Yeah, I'm gonna I didn't think nothing myself. was popping in uh, Tennessee other than Dolly Parton. <laughs> 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 so we got the uh, we got the Uncle Nears ride, which is a hundred proof. All right, so. Uh, we've been doing, what do we have, 80 and 84 proof right. uh, last week and week before last. Uh, so now we up to 100. So we're a little closer to... So now we're in a respectable range. Yeah, we're yeah, in a respectable yeah. range, right? So now, now my counterparts can feel at ease right. having a drink. We're going to see what this court sounds like. So Angry Principal do us the favor. All right, pause for the court. Eh. Ain't nothing that wrong killed it. But yeah. it's an actual cork. So it's an actual cork, though. That's, that's, yeah. that's what's different. It's yeah. an actual cork. That rum killed it, though. That shit sounds like genie yeah. in the bottle ass oh, pot, right? <laughs> yeah, like, I'm going to try not to pour heavy on this one. I'm taking a bigger pour on this one. <laughs> <laughs> right, here you go. Hold it up. So instead of corn, you got, <laughs> so instead of corn in the mash bill, you got rice in the in the mash bill, right? And that's sure. that's the difference. So we we're gonna be expecting a little bit more pep- peppery, yeah, on, and just a little bit more spice as we start to drink this. Hmm. I surprisingly, a lot of times you can smell the pepper in the rice. Why it smell like it's gonna be sweet? I can smell like the spiciness. I guess you could say not so much pepper. But some kind but of spices. Yeah. But I smell the sweetness you're talking about. Yeah, that's the right. hell of smell the sweetness. Let's see what it is. That's what that I'm talking about. That spice is immediate. That's what I'm immediate. talking about. Immediate. That that's what good. I'm talking about. Boy, hold up. That's what I'm talking about. That's hold up. It's, it's spice in the front, that's in the middle, about. in right. the back. All the way. It don't linger, though. It's not a long, it's not a long finish. Yeah, it disappeared. It's not a long finish. This is some good shit. This is good. I haven't been disappointed with Uncle Nears yet. I ain't even gonna hold you up. So it's 
It's just the right amount of sweetness. I ain't gonna lie, the smelling it. It disappears. That's the only it disappears. My only knock on it is it disappears. I like that though. Yeah. I like that. Okay. Yeah. I want the long The long finish. <laughs> yeah. It's got the hug. You know, you know what? It's yeah, it's got the it. hug for sure. Man. Like I, you think said, that's, just I think just the right amount of sweetness. Yeah, mm-hmm. just the right amount. I think that's why I don't mind it disappearing. Because the hug is so nice. I let that motherfucker go. I'm straight. <laughs> yeah, this is all right right here. Mm. I'm going to tell you right now, okay. and, and this is not just because I'm an Uncle Nearest fan, but this is the, the best rye whiskey that I've had. And at 100 proof, it's like, and I will tell you this, though. I think the the scent or the nose on it is a bit sweet, but don't let that discourage you because it's not it don't actually taste that sweet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, for, it, it got, see, for me, like, I got a, I got a real, I got the spicy notes. Like, it really had a spicy aroma to me, but uh, I can smell the sweetness as well, you know. But like I think it's just just right sp- sweetness spiciness. Spices. Yeah, you know, I, Angry Principal said I wish the hug lasts a little bit longer for me, but uh, that's really my only knock on it. Yeah, I'm cool with the hug in it. Every note that you would want a ride to have this is in it. Gotcha. And then on top of it, it's not harsh. Yeah, no, it's not, not harsh at all. all. Nice little sweet offset to it. Yeah. This is a uh, shit fire. <laughs> <laughs> this shit fire. I like this shit, dog. For sure. That's off the phone. We were on this one. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Shout out to I'm glad the they made it like widely available. Yeah. Instead for of sure. something you can get there. Yeah. And, and you know, for me, I got excited. So that's why I put it in the group text. I'm like, dog, I found a ride out here. I'm going to grab it for the show. Because I, I hadn't seen this. I heard about it, but I hadn't seen it. So at this point, I've actually, yep, I've experienced all of them, I think, then at that point. Because we had. The uh, I had the nineteen. What's the what's the the green label one? The one that they don't, yeah. don't never fucking sell. Mm-hmm. I had a couple shots of that accidentally because somebody had it and didn't know what it was. So mm-hmm. I'm drinking the hell out of that shit. That shit was fire. But I will say the uh, the one you got me the was the distiller's cut or what is it? Uh, uh, not the distiller's cut. I forgot the name of it. Yeah, it's in the box up there. But, box. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so that one was good. This rye has been good. Uh, either one, the hundred proof or the ninety four proof is good. So like, we haven't went wrong with this. You know, I'm oh, sorry. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. No, go ahead. No, and just one other thing. I think that's it. Also goes to show like how important ingredients are, right? Mm-hmm. Like Angry Principal said, you know, they're their own self self contained farm, right? You know, right. Like, they're they control, you know, how much whatever they want to, you know, put into their exactly crop or whatever you want to call. I'm not a farmer, though? so I don't know what they call it. But their harvest, I guess, harvest, right? Yeah. You know, yeah. Like, How dope is that? Ingredients is, is very important when you go and distill shit. Like, and you got your own shit and it's yeah. homegrown. It, it pays I, off, man. You can tell. You can tell. So, yeah, I definitely, I, I love it. And the only reason, another reason, rather, uh, why I think it's important to note the fact that consistently it's been good. Because a lot of times, like, it's a, it's a money grab. Like, mm. you, you know that you're making money. Yeah. So, you just put out whatever. Mm-hmm. I'm enjoying the fact that they still paying attention to quality. Yeah, this shit is this shit is fire. Now it is. Uh, uh, I'm trying to remember. I think it was fifty. It's fifty nine. I'm not sure because I don't buy a lot of rye whiskeys, so I'm not sure if that's high on the rye end. No, that's about right. It's about, that's about, about right. Yeah, okay, about all right. Yeah, so I wasn't sure. For whatever reason, the ryes are a little bit more. Expensive. A little bit more. Expensive. Okay, yeah. so yeah, I wasn't sure. So that's why I was like, I, I had to ask y'all because I know y'all drink rye whiskey, but. Uh, the only one that I've had that I thoroughly enjoyed before this was the Traverse City Rye, and this is hands down better than that. Oh, yeah. So yeah, I think this is this now, pretty it, dope. It this is gonna be high for me. Slightly young. Mm-hmm. It's not. Is I wonder if they are gonna have some versions where a little bit more mature. Mm-hmm. They left it in the barrel just a little longer. Yeah. It's slightly young, but at the same time, it's still not missing on any of the taste. No. All right. So you think that? Uh, not as young or a little bit older, you think it'll be uh, uh, perfect? It'd be perfect. But right now, I like very, like very, it's yeah. extremely good. <laughs> right now, I, I, I wonder what it would taste like with some age on it. Shit, mm-hmm. Booker's. <laughs> <laughs> That's what that shit tastes like. Yeah. Fucking Booker's. Yeah. <laughs> and that then, shit right there. The, that shit uh, burning chest. <laughs> the pepper taste come out with the, comes out with the cigar. The cigar. Mm-hmm. You you get a little bit more spice. So if you like the spice, mm-hmm. you definitely get it if you, if you smoke it with a good cigar. Yeah, it's not a. Uh, I think the only thing that we probably on different pages on is the, uh, the the long the the long finish or the lack of a long finish. Yeah. I'm cool with that. Y'all want it to linger a little bit. Yeah, longer. I like it to linger a little bit. Yeah. You know, I I don't mind it. You uh-huh. know, obviously, but it, you know, if I'm, if I'm picking like my my perfect whiskey, bourbon, whatever, it's gonna, yeah, it's gonna have a long finish. Yeah. yeah, we had one. I can't remember what. 
bourbon that was. It had a long ass finish though. Damn, I think we was recording at your crib one time. I can't remember what it was. It was a hell of a long finish though. Like we did <laughs> went through a couple shots and still sitting there like, dog, what's going on? <laughs> I see that shit right there. That's too much for me. I'm straight. I need to hit it, let it get gone. You know what I'm saying? So I for me, this is that's that's perfect, dog. But anyway, we go go around the uh we gonna go around the block and see uh what the the rating is from one black power fist up to five all right so this is our rating system uh we're gonna go in reverse this time bo i'm gonna start with you uh what you want to give it dog yeah uh, i don't have a i really don't have any complaints man you right. know it's just some some nice to haves right you know I'm, I'm gonna give it a solid i'm gonna give it a solid four for sure. you know I, I think i think it's on point yeah. you know uh only reason i'm not giving it the five is because like I'm, I'm had some bourbon out there that woo, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you get know, you together, right? Shit, for sure. You know? yeah. But that's the only reason. So uh, yeah. yeah, I get I get this solid solid four. All right, for sure. Angry principal, what about you? I have to agree. Mm -hmm. Four all the way. Man. I just would. I want. I'm interested to see how it would taste if it was a little older. Mm -hmm. But Boy. aside from that, I'm giving it a four. Just the way it is right now, yeah. I'm giving it a four for sure. All right, I think we in agreement on that. It's a, it's a four all day for me. Um, I'm gonna say like this though. I think if it's if it's aged a little bit longer, it's probably gonna be a higher proof. And I think I'm I'm straight. I think I, <laughs> I think I, I'm cool at the hundred. I'm cool at the hundred. Cause like you age a little bit more, it's gonna be looking at one oh nine, one ten. I'm straight. I'm and and the only reason I say that is because <laughs> I'm gonna say that's not about perfect. With the, yeah. with the higher proof and that much pepper in it, I can't do it. See, I, so I'm not really a rye drinker. So, okay, okay. so 110 with that and that pepper, because that pepper hitting you off rip. Like yeah, it ain't so, the it ain't the pepper finish. It's the as huh, soon as it hits the tongue, me. it's on there. So it's in the smell, it's in the taste. Exactly. So yeah, no, that, I can't that do shit it. Is shocking off. For real. Exactly. Yeah, what yeah. one tier with the pepper? It's lights out. That's like the they got it made vice president. Let's go ahead and bust that open. <laughs> like that's it. That's the only way I'm doing that. But yeah, this was solid four though. I think I've given all the Uncle Nears up to this point uh, a four. And I, it's gonna be. I don't. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't think I'm ever gonna give anything a five because we're steadily finding new stuff. So I'm almost afraid to give something a five because then I'm gonna find something better that's gonna make it not perfect. So perfect, like nobody's gonna get a perfect score. So I'm gonna give it a good four though. Uh, I think we uh consistent across the board on that. Uncle Nears, thank you for keeping the quality up to par, man. Shout out to the uh, black woman leadership over there, dog. That's what's so you, up. So you just said something about being vice president. Yeah, when Kamala runs for president a couple uh, four years from now, she needs to definitely take a visit and do one of her campaign trips for at sure. Uncle Nears. For sure, that's just not just just a highlight. Well, first get, of all, if you talk about all the rednecks, on you talking about Kamala Harris, like is she still alive? Like it, who is she? <laughs> Is she I'm actually saying, there? She there. Is everybody well, when, there? This is a whole episode of Weekend at Bernie's. When she like, does it, she needs to make, <laughs> make a trip specifically down to Uncle Nears and do her now, campaign. I was talking about that. vice president of a corporation. Hey, you said vice president. You didn't stipulate. Was, so I'm just saying. Is Kamala Harris still alive? Hey, you welcome to use that idea, Kamala. Just go ahead. Yeah. yeah hey, come up off that bench. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, though. We about to get back to drinking, man. Still with the same shirt on from the last three weeks. Don't worry about that, though. Send an uh, send a offer to our GoFundMe account. Yeah. <laughs> we going to keep it moving, dog. Till the next time, man. Let's get out of here. We're going to finish drinking, man. Till the next time. You already know what it is, man. Beers, bourbon, whiskey. Everybody loves BBW, man. Got my man Angry Principal off camera. Drink what you like. How you like. <laughs> my man Bo holding it down. I say. And, of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live. <laughs> For the 4205, man. Peace out, y'all. Ross, you ain't off the hook, bro. <laughs> right. <laughs>